up, divas and divos? It's your girls. April. No, I'm April. I know you didn't. You say, say your own name. Oh, well, you usually say it first. No, but I was when you do it this time. Oh, you do first. Okay, do you want me to do it again? Yeah. What's up, divas and divos? It's your girl, April and Mumsy, and we are back to do a dollar store haul. Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, same Thank thing. Fabric. I'll pull your heartstrings brick by brick. Make you love me. Hey girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill you up. Hey girl, this is definitely love. Hey girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill you up. Hey girl, this is definitely love. Brick by brick. Yeah. What's up, divas? It's your girls, April and Mumsy. And we're back to do another Dollar Tree video haul, right, your girlfriend? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't have to be all modest. You <laughs> can just... We have two hauls today. One's from the Dollar Tree and the other is from... The 99 cent store. Which the... She went without me. She said she was going to wait for me when I got back from school. I didn't say that about the 99 cents only store. Well, you I said the Dollar Tree. Oh, well. There are two different places. We went to Dollar Tree today. Still, you So I still went. Me. You, I didn't say I was going to take you to a 99 cents only store. You didn't mention it. I know. I didn't know I was going. Oh. Well, we went today to the Dollar Tree. So don't even listen to Mumsy. She also went to Walmart, right? We did find some cool stuff. Um, Mumsy got some stuff from the Dollar Tree. And yesterday when I went without her, I still got her something from the 99 cents only the 99 cents. <laughs> Dang. The 99 cents only store. So the first part we're going to show you is the Dollar Tree. This is like a couple of trips. So would you have, oh, you weren't at any of them, huh? You was at one of them. Yeah, one. Today and the other one. So she doesn't even know what she's talking about. So the first thing we got, I don't remember, I don't know if you guys remember, but a few months ago, I had bought like two dish racks from the Dollar Tree, okay? And I was really happy about it because they were only a buck, you know, you can't beat that. But the thing that they didn't come with was the bottom portions, which are these, okay? So I never took them back. I just kept them. I was going to purchase these from like Walmart, but finally the Dollar Tree has these. So I was really glad when I seen these. They do have two colors. They have black and white because they also have two dish racks, which are black and white. Um, I really wish they would have the black dish racks when I purchased mine originally because I think like black is just a lot better. You know, white, you can sometimes see everything on, but for a buck, you know, you can always go back and get them. They're rather small, so that's the reason why I got two of them. But hey, for a dollar, you're actually spending two. It's still a lot cheaper than buying them like from Walmart because in reality, they kind of are like almost the same size, but the ones at Walmart are like five bucks. So also from the Dollar Tree, you guys know I love socks, so I do pick up quite a few. And I I love socks that are like really kind of like fun and stuff and kind of like fun and funky so these were the actual men's and their men's dress socks I thought these were so cute because they have hot dogs and french fries on them let me see aren't they cute don't get any ideas homegirl about I taking my socks I just can't see them when you're let me take them. these then hmm you gotta watch her and these ones are also men's which and these are also dress socks that and these men's. are that's what it says girl like girl socks. I thought these look like girls too but these say like men's boys. and boys wearing those. well, I don't either, but they dress socks and they are like pina colada drinks on them. Like, see, so these are really cute too. Kind of girly. I think so too. I, those look like men's, but these do actually look like girls because just the colors in them. But I'm definitely going to wear these because I thought these were so cute. Don't be getting no ideas much. about my socks. Okay. Yum. And then, oh, is it cheeseburgers on there too? Yeah, cheeseburger right here. Oh, yes. You know, I love cheeseburgers. So, what? Cheeseburgers, hot dogs, and french fries. These are cute, right? Mm -hmm. You don't get no idea. I know. Good. Because she, she got, well, she just took them off, but she had all my other little Dollar Tree socks. Let's talk about they were in her drawer. They were. I wonder why. Hmm. We got some cool makeup because they did have some new makeup at the Dollar Tree. I swatched them before I purchased them, but I was really pleased with this outcome. This is the LA Colors Matte All Day Finish Liquid Lipstick. So this one here is called In The Mood, and it's like this reddish, like a very deep red. It's not for me. It's for my daughter, Tatiana. 
who loves like the color red and i will be honest and say she looks really pretty in red kind of like a burgundy-ish kind of red then this one is a pinkish color kind of like a mauve color which is called kiss don't tell um, there was also like a purplish lavender color and another pink color so for the two colors these are them really pretty for a dollar you can't go wrong it doesn't feel like it's drying my lips however i did have some lipstick on prior to applying this but i do like the fact that it was only a buck and it's a flat smooth color and it's only a dollar once again so for a dollar you're not even saying it like you I'm mean it <laughs> so you have to say it like you mean it i'm for, sorry for a dollar make me holler a little bit louder. For a dollar. Make me holla. There you go, honey. So also, I did pick up another one of their LA Colors um, highlight makeup things. Um, glowing skin. Um, this one right here. I did pick up two of these in the past. One was, um, they were for my daughter, Nay. But the color was so pretty and rich. Like, so for a dollar. For a dollar. Oh, sorry. Make me holla. You can't beat this. Um, this one here, I'm not really sure if they have names. They actually do not have names. This just is called a highlighter, illuminator, and they have numbers. So these are supposed to be pocket um, travel sizes, but they also do have bronzers. Now, this is nothing really too new because I did see these prior at the um, Dollar Tree like some months ago, and they sold out really quick. They had two different kind of bronzers. Um, which was a little bit one was a little bit darker and this highlight for a buck is actually really nice So this is the color and I love highlights like this Let me try some on your cheekers. No. Come on okay. Ooh, You're glowing. I just put too way too much, right? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'll just like oh you're rubbing it in. I'm just wrapping it off a little bit. Okay. Well, I'm already highlighted, so. Oh, it's still on my skin, girl. For a dollar, this is a pretty color, like, for real. This is great for, like, people that are just starting out with makeup, like you. <laughs> She's looking at me like, I ain't wearing makeup. <laughs> and when you're done at the end of the day, you need to make sure to clean your face off. So, bam. Bam. You have facial fa um, facial brushes. You messing me up. Revitalize <laughs> facial brushes. So I got this for my son Wuzzle because he loved to make sure that his face looked nice and clean and stuff. For the like, ladies. For the what? The ladies. For the ladies, okay? So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely check these out. These are really some good facial cleansing brushes. I mean, listen, there are some that you can spend a lot for, but for a dollar, these do have like a cap inside that you can take off. So that way your brush is not hitting like any type of bacteria. But listen, you can definitely throw them away. They're only a buck. So, you know, just, you know, get you some. Get you some, right? Mm -hmm. I purchased these. Let me tell you, I have a couple of these, but I don't purchase them for um, the facial brushes. Um, I use them for the wigs. Mm. So, like, uh, when I wash in a wig that I have, and say that wig has, like, gel or glue or just hairspray that's in the wig or in the side of the cap, I use these just to get it out because they're gentle. They're not abrasive. So, these were great for that. So, that is what I use it. Now, on to the, well... It's fun. It's about to be fun. It's always fun. It's always lit. Our Dollar Tree videos are always lit. Right, girl? Mm-hmm. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> so, also, at the Dollar Tree, we did pick up a Zootopia game. You want to explain that, girlfriend? You uh, got to show it off. I'm sorry. I don't even know how to play this. Well, I'll hold it because you're hiding your cute little face. Okay. It's a Zootopia. Uh, you know what? I think it's like, okay, so Zootopia. let's see. Let's see, Topia. I said Zootopia. Oh. I'm going to smack you with this <laughs> box. And so, it's a, this is not the Dollar Tree. This is a Zootopia. The game is called Zootopia. Suspect I'm not Search. Saying it. You're saying Zootopia. That, what is it? It's Zootopia. Zootopia. <laughs> it's Zootopia. Anyway. Oh God, okay. Saying. You know that show, Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? <laughs> I guess that's what no. this is because she's in the fifth grade, so we're about to play that. I'm not really sure how much this actually really did cost, but for a dollar, 
definitely we about to holler. This is like a suspect search game. I thought it would be cute for her and Tinky to play together. It's gonna destroy it. Okay, well it was only a buck, so who cares? I'm thinking, is it like a memory game? We used to play board games a lot. We would have like family fun okay. night. I think like stuff like this is really fun. Like I like to play Candyland with them and Monopoly and stuff like that. So you know, got it. Always it's nice to spend time with your kids and just like do family things. Then also, I thought these. Go ahead. That one's cute. That one's my favorite. This one's your favorite? Mm -hmm. So, I'm not really sure what these are or what you do with these little things. They're called Yokai Watch. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm not really sure what you do with these. But I thought they were really cute at the Dollar Tree. And I knew Mumsy would know what it was. And she would want one. So, I just thought they were really cute to put on her room shelf. With well, I don't know if you can change their faces with it. It says right here in the back. See oh, stickers? glow in the dark eye stickers. Oh, Ooh. but what do you like? What do you do with this? You. This is like a collect glow in the dark eye stickers. Well, what do you do with those this? Gamer people that just leave them on their shelves. Don't so open see, it. So see, that's what I thought you could do with it because I thought you would think it was cute. It. This one's okay. Cute. That one's cute. Donnie got two of them. Yeah, you get the robot one. The robot one's kind of weird. The ugly one. Yeah. Oh. Listen, these were only a dollar. If you get these elsewhere, you're spending way more than a buck. They have them at Target. Do they? Yeah. Also, just our normal. These are the Brillo Swiffer Wet Jet. Swiffer Wet Jets. I love those. You get eight in a the pack. They're very moist. They'll clean your floor. I'm not saying mop, mop your entire house, but definitely, you know, for little spills, right? And little, yeah. little markings. You could definitely keep your floors a lot cleaner. So we always get those. These soft and gentle feminine wipes are amazing. Um, normally I get the ones that have the flip lid, but they ran out of them. So these will work just as well. You get 20 in a pack. Or no, you get 30 in a pack. And you know, you can keep them with you. You can carry them around in your purse. Either way, these are really essential for women and just young ladies, girls in general. One of my favorite things at the Dollar Tree, because I have carpeting and I love my rugs to smell clean. I'm not like a huge fan of wall-to-wall -wall carpeting. I would rather, if it was my choice, have hardwood floors. But being that I don't, I definitely like to keep it smelling fresh and clean. So I'm constantly getting it clean, but I also do have a new vacuum and I'm loving it. But let me tell you guys, I have tried different carpet cleaners from the Dollar Tree. Um, and this one um, is the best one, in my opinion. This one smells so good. This is the Arm & Hammer one. This brand, I always I always seem to find this in the pet section. It's probably because it has like dog yeah, pet um pet fresh carpet oil eliminator. But it has like the best scent ever and it you may be getting a little bit more versus the other one, but I just think like this one is way better than like I love my carpet brand or those other brands are that are like next to detergent, like in a cylinder kind of like bottle. They okay, but this one is like way better. Like once you put this down and let it sit for like five to ten minutes i let it sit for like 30 minutes you can smell it through your whole entire house so like i love this i use one box um every few days amazing amazing so definitely if you need some type of carpet refreshing i would highly suggest getting the arm and hammer one because this one is the best one that they have what are you gonna do with that glue your mouth shut mm -hmm. <laughs> now i'm gonna make um slime so she's gonna make slime you get two bottles for a dollar or you can get the elmer's one for one buck and of course I, I guess they all work the same right because you always use that one yeah yeah mm -hmm. so you get two for a dollar mm -hmm. for a dollar make me howl she don't say but she's howling too much <laughs> so you guys know how i've been going through stuff with my teeth and whatever so i'm like really funny when it comes to like my teeth and when i seen crest 3d white toothpaste at the daggone dollar tree no they don't crest they no have. they don't have 3d white oh they always have crest but they never have the 3d white so bam oh my god <laughs> bam when i seen this i was like hunties I'm about to get a whole bunch of these. Now, you know if you go to Walmart or somewhere, you are not getting this for a buck. Okay? Yeah. So, for a dollar. Make me holla. Make me holla with some Crest 3D White. Okay? And of course, you guys, you know, I'm always getting, like, my mobile gadget device things at the Dollar Tree. They got some really cute new headphones. 
which are like this blue with polka dots, which I absolutely think are cute. The kids love them, so I always make sure to get them like a bunch of different headphones because, listen, I always tell you guys, I'm not about to spend $10 on headphones when they're constantly breaking them. These work just as well. If you will always wonder why am I always buying headphones, it's because they either get lost or get broken, stepped on. Last night I went into Wuzzle's room, my son, he had two headphones on the floor and one pair was like not a cheap pair either they're sitting there so they probably don't work now because he's probably even stepped all on them but definitely if you're at the Dollar Tree you can get your mobile devices like accessories like headphones and also you can also get the uh, USB cables the one thing to getting these USB cable charger pieces are this. Make sure at the bottom that you, when you're looking, they say high speed charging and data transfer. Some of them just say charging and data transfer, which means it's going to take a little bit longer to um, charge up your device. So definitely make sure to look at the bottom here where it'll say high speed and they'll last just as well. A little bit of arts and crafty items we did get. Mumsy's gonna make me like a nice picture, right? What do you want me to draw? I don't know, but they got some stretch canvases now, and they're so cute, right? I've seen they have like all sizes. Want me to draw you a food? No, you can draw whatever animal. you want. Whatever you want. I have like this um wall in my kitchen with nothing but photos and pictures on, and I thought these were cute because these are at the Dollar Tree. They're just canvases. You can paint on them. They come in an array of sizes. I mean, you're not getting like the biggest size. I think this was the biggest one right mm -hmm. and this one is a six by eight inch and then there's like a five by seven and they do get a little bit smaller but i think these are really great because you can display them in your home as artwork or what have you and the kids can make something really cool really cute for painting and just doing arts and crafts like you like to do so we did see some new succulents at the dollar tree and i was so excited about that because i do have some succulents already here in my home and i've decorated with them but they got some new ones a couple of different new ones and i was so excited about that one I've seen them. These ones here are the cactus ones, and they are just lovely, honey. Lovely. Then they have some bamboos. Now, I wasn't too um, wild and crazy about the pots for the cactus ones, but the funny thing is, I actually have these because of the succulents that I got last year. I depotted them and did something totally different. So I'll probably switch them out. So I already have an idea of what I wanna do with these succulents um, because I just love like that feng shui type of nice serenity vibe. So I did pick up eight of these. Also, I have three of these. And these are the terrium planters, okay? So you can hang these up if you want to in your home or on your back porch or wherever, but you can also remove them. So my idea oh. is I'm going to put these in them. We're going to kind of like fill them up. I only got three because I already have an idea of what I want to do. We also have like some reindeer moss with the reindeer moss that you can also pick up at Dollar Tree. So I thought these were really cute for a buck. You know, you can also make these into like little bird feeders. Um, all kind of things you can do with these arts and crafts. But I thought these terrarium terrarium planters were absolutely super cute especially because you can put the succulents in them and make like all types of little things this one she'll be taking a little prickles <laughs> off my cactus wow so yeah i did get three of these command self-adhesives i love these things because these actually really do work oh my god if you would it's just like, imagine the things that you can do Christmas with these decoration. yeah but i also put my like my plug thing to the wall with this like amazing i love these things and then also we was at the um, we was at Walmart. I know this is not part of the Dollar Tree, but listen, I love stuff to make my house smell good. And some things like certain candles, like at Walmart and stuff, I don't really mess with. But let me tell y'all, I was at um, Sally's Beauty Supply Store. I walked in and I was like, oh my God, like this great aroma of peach just hit me in the face and you could smell throughout the whole store. So I asked the girl, what did she use? She said she went and got the peach um, wax melts, okay? from Walmart next door, Better Homes and Gardens. So I did purchase this already and it does really smell good. So girl, I had to go get another pack. They're only $2, um, but they did have some on clearance for $1.50. And this one right here, which is the Balms, Firewood and Balms, also smells really good. I love the smell of pine, like Christmas tree pine, because it, it just leaves like a really good everlasting scent in your home. And also I did get, which one is that? 
Cinnamon. Stick. Cinnamon stick. And that cinnamon also does smell really, really rich too. It's All right, now to the 99 cents only store, you know, where Mumsy was shading me because I went without her. But I did get her something really cute, which is ba bam. <laughs> right? Ba bam. So we are still collecting stuff for her future bedroom, and I cannot wait to just hook it up for her because I'm really good at decorating, <laughs> I think. Right? What do you think? Mm -hmm. I think this is really cute for 99 cents. Okay? Listen. This is super cute. It says, dance with fairies, ride unicorns. Ride a unicorn. Ride a unicorn. Okay, excuse me. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? <laughs> <laughs> Dance with fairies, ride a unicorn, swim with mermaids, and chase rainbows. Is this cute or what? Like, you cannot beat this for, like, your daughter's room or even, like, a, a anybody's room. This is so cute for a buck. Then it has a thing on the back. So it's made really good. It's only a dollar for a dollar. Take me how. I, I know. I was not shading oh, you. Sorry. <laughs> I was not shading her. Huh? Once again, I did get some more um, earbuds. I could not pass these up. These are like some really good ones. So I mean, red and got blue. yeah, look at them. They're really cute. See, nice like. Um, these are like um, really good ones. E um, noise oscillating. I love these. So yeah. All a dollar. Players. Let me tell you something. The kids will definitely lose them. Okay, <laughs> so I always make sure to like rack up on like, electronic stuff. And then I seen these at the ninety nine cents. Oh, I do got a pink one too. Look. Oh, I thought about you when I got that one because I know you love pink. <laughs> Did she just throw my stuff on the floor? <laughs> do you want me to show it off? It was like this metallic pink, and I had thought about her when I picked it up. <laughs> We're going to just move on to the next. So, I did see these also at the 99 cents only store, and I thought these were really good for a dollar. These are the six outlet wall taps. Okay, I thought these were really good for a dollar. I was telling my mother about these. These are by the Western House brand. I've heard that brand is supposed to be a really good brand. They're not like anything generic. They're just as good as like General Electric. So I was telling my mom about these. She was like, don't use them. Your house might catch on fire because they're, <laughs> she, she thinks that because they're at like the 99 cents only store that they're going to like, you know, catch on fire um or they're not regulated i'm not really sure but when i told my husband about them as well he said the exact same thing so i'm not really sure what do you guys think of like purchasing things like this from the 99 purchasing cents only enough store? for you girl i know she's always your business <laughs> um you know like i like this brand this is a good brand i've seen this brand being sold at like home depot oh, i don't Lord. think this is a bad brand weston house but you know some people are really leery about where they get their you know electronic things at but i really would like to know you guys opinion this one here i got was a swivel adapter and this is just this kind and you know it'll swivel it'll lay flat up against the one you can put like three in it and i've purchased these before from like a dollar tree like um extension cords and things like that and they've never given me any issues so I was kind of excited when I saw this because I needed one of these and I've never seen them at any kind of like discount store. So I'm saying. So also at the 99 cents only store, they have some really nice plantain stuff, like outdoorsy things, plants, whatever. You know what I mean? I love like stuff that is like make your house look really nice, home decor. So these I seen for a dollar at the 99 cents only store. Well, they're 99 cents, okay? And these are the Garden Ease um, brand. These I thought was so nice. These are planters, planters, but I had an idea of my own. Putting mints in them. Putting my mints in them. I have these mints that I absolutely love. Like, I love these mints. Do I have any in a look on look on my table? Anymore? So, like I was saying, I'm I, I'm going to put my mints in here. I know you guys are like, what? I'm going to spray paint it gold or silver because I have shiny metallic gold and silver spray paint and these are so pretty because they are like stone kind of like bark looking kind of like tree thing like and i i love mints and you guys are like what are you talking about mints i'm gonna take them out of the thing She's gonna eat it. i'm not gonna eat it ASMR. mints okay mints now i get these from walmart and i absolutely love them they're by the brand bob's sweet stripes 
These are delicious. You can get a container that has 200 or you can be cheap and buy a little bag full. I buy the two containers at a time and I have this big candy dish and I'm the only one that eats them. Now Tinky likes them too. But I'm always like, can I have some mints? My mom loves mints. My mom got mints. This is what all he says to me now, my, my grandson. My mom mints. My mom got mints. I love Would these. Like yeah, but was better watch himself taking my mints. So, I figured I needed a candy dish in the living room. But I don't really like the a typical old lady looking candy dishes. <laughs> These are so good. They get soft in the middle. Let me tell you. I might as well eat it. They're delicious. I'm going to put them in here and have them in my living room and make it look nice. That's what these are for. I thought these were really, really cute. You know, you can either keep them this color or you can definitely like pick them up and get like some good spray paint and just be like really creative so no you can use them for just basically anything and like I was saying I didn't want my candy dish to look like that old lady glass kind of like because that's what I was gonna go for you know like the glass dishes granny like the granny but I wanted it something some more modern so definitely this is modern for me and then the two last things that I've seen at the 99 cent store were these these are absolutely cute. These are also from the garden section. And these are ceramic pots. I've seen something somewhat like these at the Dollar Tree, but they're not little pots. They're like some type of candle holders. These are still just as cute. When I seen them, I was like in love with them because I thought they were so amazing. I thought these would be so cute for the succulents. Look at that. You can do a bunch of different things with these. You can use them for your candles. You can stack them. Be really, really creative. But I thought these were so cute. They came in silver, gold, and rose gold. So I just got two gold and two silvers. What do you think? Nice. Nice. And it also has some, some type of little succulents, but you would definitely want to depot them. I wouldn't keep them in here. But definitely, if you're at a 99 cents only store or even at the Dollar Tree, you can get something like these, very similar, and just put your little succulents in them. Just depot them, and they'll look really, really cute. So, you guys, that is it for our Dollar Tree slash 99 cents only haul. We hope you guys enjoyed it. We haven't been doing them as much as lately. This is We just haven't been doing them as much as we used to because, you know, I don't really want to buy everything at the Dollar Tree. Like... Then I won't have any room in my house. And some of the things that I do get are like household cleaning items. And I'm pretty sure you guys are not interested in that. However, I will do a video very soon on the most needed and wanted Dollar Tree cleaning items to get from the Dollar Tree. If you guys want to see that, then definitely thumbs this video up and leave a comment below. And me and Mumsy will definitely do that. She's like fixated on looking at herself and the thing. Hello. <laughs> hello. So, would you like to say goodbye now? Stop picking yeah, at my I'm thing. Sorry. I'm, I'm going to punch her in her eye <laughs> off camera. I'm about to punch her in her eye. Okay. <laughs> so, on that note, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs this video up. Let us know what you think of us. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe at Mumsy's channel. She has her own YouTube channel, which is Mumsy's World. Make sure you go over there, subscribe, and show your support. Share with everybody on all your social media. Hello. <laughs> Turn the notifications on. Jeez. <laughs> and, yes, you guys, we will see you in a soon-to-come video. Bye. 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 You're so freaking mean. <laughs> like, jeez. You're like, what is wrong you with you? You said you were going to put you in my face. Yeah, I said your eye, not your face. Still, they're a part of my face, oh, and I need them. God, you're rude. I yeah, know. Yeah, put your glasses on, blindy. <laughs> hey! Sit right there, you fucker. Hey, and what else do we have that we can hold on? I'm trying to find like the perfect thumbnail. Mm -hmm. No, don't do that, you look stupid. <laughs> no? No.